And don't forget the impact of all these flavors on not just your taste buds, but on your smell, your olfactory mm -hmm. receptors. They're also picking up a lot of those Everything. notes. So it's all really like a concert, like an orchestra. Welcome to Savored, a skin series where we put trending drink and food items to the test. I'm Kanchan Koya. I'm the Chief Spice Mama and the author of the book, Spice Spice Baby. So we're gonna start with the Jalapa Jars Mild Salsa. Mmm. Seems like perfect for the summer. It feels spicy, but not too spicy because there is such a nice balance from the freshness. There's a bit of pineapple in it. Ooh, so I think that definitely contributes that to that it. sweet, summery feeling. Mm -hmm. There's definitely a kick, but it's, you know, it doesn't linger. It's like yeah. an aggressive high five instead of a kick. I love that, <laughs> aggressive high five. So other than chips, you know, what would you recommend pairing the salsa with? So I'm thinking a breakfast burrito with eggs, cheese on your favorite tortilla, maybe some spinach stirred in for that green action and then dip it in the salsa. Now we're gonna try Trader Joe's take on their Zoog sauce. I have had so many people tell me I need to try this. I've also heard because it's cilantro based, it's mm. sort of like a Middle Eastern pesto or even more so a chimichurri. So excited, it looks oh, so fresh and green. I might wanna eat it straight up. I know, <laughs> just with this beautiful little spoon. Mm. It's really reminiscent of herbs in oil with chili and garlic. I think this also has cumin and cardamom, which are giving this sort of depth of flavor. So it's like really fresh and mm -hmm. vibrant and zingy. And what sort of things would you really pair this with? I actually love this kind of condiment with something like salmon. Really? Which is like a firm, sturdy fish that can really hold up. And if you wanted to eat something plant-based, like cauliflower steaks, where you would brush this on and throw it on the grill. Just loving it for that sort of vibrancy, mm -hmm. freshness, mm -hmm. and herbaceous quality with the heat in the background. Finally, our spiciest sauce of the day, we're gonna go with Fly By Jing Sichuan Chili Crisp Sauce. Um, full confession, I have a jar of that in my fridge at all times. Really? And I'm totally obsessed. Do a dumpling cheers. A little dumpling cheers. All dumpling right. cheers. Mmm. Mm. So I have actually been to the Sichuan province in China where this peppercorn is from. And sometimes people think they're having an allergic reaction when they eat the Sichuan peppercorn because it makes your lips kind of numb and tingly. So you're not having an allergic reaction. You're just okay. having Sichuan peppercorn. Oh, I love it. You want to just bathe in it. I mean, it Ooh. really is like this amalgam of delicious flavor notes. Right. And the chili is mm -hmm. like an unparalleled flavor experience. Definitely. That's a great way to put it, flavor experience. Don't feel like you have to only enjoy it with the noodles and dumplings, which That's of course true. is delicious. Right. You can really take it in a lot of different directions. I definitely love it on my avocado toast. You could also throw it on the smash burger trend, which everyone's doing it. I know this is gonna sound out there, but Hit are me. you ready? Hit me. That's why we're here. That's why we're here. Vanilla ice cream. That is as out there as <laughs> it gets. You know, people mix sweet and spicy a lot, like All Mexican hot chocolate. I think a little bit of this in a vanilla ice cream would your guests would be like, what is happening? Oh my gosh, I love it. Catch me putting it on my avocado toast, for sure. For sure. Every morning. No. Which one was your favorite? Well, I am Latina and I do love a good chimichurri sauce and, and anything related to it. I might have to go with the first one. Whichever you choose, make sure to take it one dip at a time. Hungry for more? Check out our editor picks at theskim.com slash savored. Yeah, no, these are definitely coming home with me. <laughs> yeah. Here you go. Just thank you, just don't tell anybody.